Today we're going to talk about bogus bacon and why you should stay away from it. Hey there, njroot22.com. Today with a little, uh, I don't know what, it's, what this is, low carb or product review or whatever. But um, the, the product we're talking about in particular here is called uh, Greenfield Natural Meat Company Bacon. Um, and there's a lot of similar, uh, many similar products to this where they have this big bold thing on there. This 12 ounce package is around uh, 12 bucks. What are, I mean, I'm sorry, 12 ounce pack was around seven bucks. And just as comparison, $7.99 in fact, I think. Um, you can get four packs of the same size 12 ounce Jimmy Dean Bacons for the same price as one of these little, uh, these marketing bacons. I don't know what, what you want to call them, but uh, in big bold letters on the packaging, it's clear to see uh, there's pork raised with no antibiotics, no gro growth hormones, and it's humanely raised. Uh, wait a minute, wasn't the animal killed for this? And what, what difference does it make how humane it was? Anyway, vegetarian feed for this non-vegetarian product. And then gluten-free, the big magic gluten-free because all these people need to be gluten-free. And I, I, I always thought that all slabs of bacon were gluten-free. I, I don't see any wheat in the meat. No wheat in the meat. Um, but this whole thing here, this plays into people's minds and their weaknesses and their, their you know, susceptibility to getting uh, sucked up into marketing. They're buzzwords, you know. And I guess maybe they forget that they're eating an animal if you have enough... Uh, vegetarian words and gluten-free and all this other stuff and hormones and antibiotics, they're going to forget that they're actually eating meat um, because of all that bold print. I'll tell you right now, I cooked this crap up and it cooked awfully. It looked, it looked like it was like a, a terminally ill patient in a hospital, like on their last... Of course, cooked bacon does look kind of terminal anyway, but um, you know, I, I called it soy boy bacon. Even though there's worse soy boy bacons out there, like turkey bacon, which is god awful. It's the worst thing ever. And then they have that entirely fake bacon made out of <laughs> literal soy or whatever that those ve vegetarian bacon. Why? Why eat bacon? Just just stick to eating dirt and leaves and grass. And just why bother eating bacon if you're not going to eat the old-fashioned Oscar Mayer bacon or go to the butcher and get a just a literal? They'll take the pig and have the side and whatever the the pork uh, belly there and they'll make bacon out of it uh, straight straight from the pig. There's no reason to go through this nonsense. Oh, nitrate free and that's a whole nother fear thing as well. So I say no. I do the regular bacon. I buy the cheap stuff at supermarkets when they're on sale and we love it if you cook it right. So if you like the video, please hit the bell, subscribe and all that and I'll see you next time.